data log of one four four three eight subject fazb entertainment product lookalike audio recording by gabriel miller archivist for fazb entertainment subject recorded in june 30th 2015 statement name the thing in my attic As I was, <clears throat> hello. Knock and knock. Hey, Samuel. You know you can just call me Sam, right? Shit. Yeah. Sorry. Kind of forgot about that. Uh, what are you doing here? Oh, you know, yeah. Just like you know, passing by and trying to collect some logs and stuff. You know, the usual. Oh, uh, do you need some help? I could probably help you find some of the... No, no, I should be fine. Thank you for the offer, though. Uh, yeah, no no problem. Um, what are you looking for, anyways? Oh, you know, nothing in particular. Just some stuff lying around for, like, you know, the, the last past two years, you know? Oh, uh... I don't think we have stuff from the past two years. The archives only go up to 2019. Really? Damn, that... that sucks. So... um... Can I help you with anything else, then? No, no, no... Oh! Oh, hey! What, what are you reading there? What? Hey, what the... Oh, hey, I know this story. Well, could you please give it back? I kind of need that to do my job. Oh, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Wait, how do you even know about this? This stuff is, like, kind of old at this point. Oh, you know, when you're an old veteran of the company, you tend to, like, you know know some things here and there about certain things and this one in particular this one was very interesting for a while wait so how is it interesting well let me tell you a story about this particular incident There is this family out in the west of Utah, somewhere out in Hurricane. It was your stereotypical American family, after all. One day, on a family outing, they would come home relatively late, and a dad would tell his son, Go get ready for bed. Yes, sir. He would say, Of course. The kid would go to his room and listen to his father. But the strangest thing would happen. The kid would hear weird sounds as he was trying to sleep. Thump, thump, thump. This kid being no younger than the age of 10 years old would go and investigate the sound. He would explore the house in search of the sound. But it sounded like the only place it could have came from was from the attic. But he wasn't certain of this, so he planned on telling his family in the morning. In the morning, he would go to his father and say, Dad, Dad, Dad I heard something last night. Something it sounded like it came from the attic. the attic. Well, I didn't hear anything last night, so you must have dreamt it. Then to his mother and say, Mom, 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 Mom 
there is something in the attic, and Dad doesn't believe me. No, no. Do as your father says. But, but, but... Okay, Mom. They would not listen to the boy's claims. And so, the day went on. Back home, the same thing would happen again. Dad, you've got to believe me. I think there's a monster in the attic. You better get ready for bed. I don't want to hear anything about some monster. He would hear the same thumping sounds coming from the attic, but something else would also be there as well. It sounded like... laughter. The young boy would go back to search for the sound, once again looking around the house to find nothing. But the boy knew it was some kind of monster and it was living in their attic. And so he would tell their family once more of his claims. Yeah, you gotta believe me. I think there is a monster in the attic. He would tell his father, but he would not believe him once more. What did I tell you about some monster? It must be some rodent or something. Mom! Mom, mom! I think there's a monster in the attic. And the same thing would happen. He would not believe the boy, or nor his claims. What are you even talking about? There's nothing in the attic. You have nothing to worry about. And so the day went on. Later that day, after the family outing, he would be sent to his room. All right, kid, you are going to stay in your room tonight. There is no monster. Yes, sir. And so he was sent to his room. But he knew if he didn't do anything to stop this monster, something would happen to his family. Thump, thump, thump. He would hear the sounds from the attic, and so he would go to investigate. And yeah, the family moved out about like a week later and they haven't been in utah ever since no way that is all true you're just pulling my leg or something
Yeah, probably. It, it's just, you know, an old story that we just tell in the office building here. I'm pretty sure it's nothing to worry about, though. You know, it's kind of strange, too, because I've had similar documents about what appears to be the same thing. No way it's Fazbear Entertainment property. Who knows? I mean, it's just a story after all. You don't believe in ghosts, do you? Is that supposed to be a rhetorical question? Yeah, I'm just messing with you, man. You gotta mess with a new guy somehow. Huh, right. Well, uh, thank you for the story, but I really gotta get back to work. I've kind of been late anyways. Alright, man. I will see you, see you on break, alright? Wait, could you close the door? Huh? Oh, yeah, sure thing. <laughs>